Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm bringing you along for a day at home with me for some cleaning, cooking, and a little bit of decorating. So hopefully you get some cleaning motivation, a recipe idea, and enjoy the video. I started my day with some breakfast and made these cute heart waffles. I now pretty much have a mini waffle maker for every holiday and season and they're just so much fun so i'm definitely loving making these during the month of february and i'll have a link for this waffle maker down below I love starting my day by making the bed in the mornings during the week. My husband does it since I leave to work so early, but on Saturdays, I start off by doing it. And then on Sundays, I wash all of our bedding. So that's just become our routine. But I think a made bed definitely sets the tone for a productive day. So I love just getting it done. And our comforter and that knit blanket are both from Target and they're so comfortable. I'll link them down below. And then I love sleeping on silk pillowcases. So those are definitely a must have for me. I'm just throwing a load of laundry in the wash and then heading downstairs to clean the kitchen. And a clean kitchen also makes me feel really productive as long as the bed is made and the kitchen is clean I feel like things are getting done so just picking things up here putting away clean dishes washing some and reloading the dishwasher and then I'm gonna add one small detail of decor in here and also add in some fresh flowers to an arrangement I've had for a while so just got some new ones to add I'm also working on a kitchen organization video soon the pantry desperately needs to be clean and organized I feel like I've just let it get pretty bad and I just need to declutter some drawers and cabinets so I will be doing all of that soon I also bought some organizational items that I'll be adding I always love just using the beginning of the year all the way up to spring to really declutter a lot of spaces in our home I feel like things really need to be clean and organized after the holidays and I feel like I actually have the motivation to declutter and organize in the beginning of the year more than any other time. So I'm going to try to tackle a space every week so it doesn't seem like way too much at one time. So hopefully by spring I'll have lots of spaces and nice and organized. And now I'm going to add in some fresh flowers to some that I already had. I've had them for a couple of weeks and I feel like they lasted a while. But some were dead or dying so I bought some new ones that I'm going to add to the ones that are still good. And I went with really bright and cheerful colors that I think are perfect for Valentine's Day. I had done just very soft colors and now that it's closer to Valentine's Day I wanted to really bring in some pinks. Um, like hot pinks and some red so I'm gonna add those to some that are still alive I love doing that just buying 
some new ones and then using the ones that are still good in the arrangements. really loving this color combination for the fresh flowers since most of our decor is pretty neutral I love having this pop of color with the flowers I think it's just perfect for Valentine's Day I'm also gonna add a wreath to our front door that I had forgotten about it's a Valentine's wreath and I just like keeping the decor pretty simple for Valentine's but I think these fresh flowers really add that pop of color and really stand out somebody I just want to love you if I'm gonna love somebody I just want to love you if I'm gonna love somebody I just want to love you oh, oh, I just want to love you right And I'm keeping this eucalyptus that just dried up, but it looks pretty nice still. I feel like they sell stuff like this. This is a dried eucalyptus at like Hobby Lobby. So just keeping that to add maybe to a vase later. But just gonna clean this up here and wipe down the countertops. Take you there. I want to be daring, baby, dance the night away. I let my head down if I want. Don't you just get tired chasing fame and being pretty all the time? And this method all purpose cleaner in the scent grapefruit is one of my newest favorites. It smells really, really good. You can do better, so much better. The only decor piece I wanted to add here is this pink book. I forgot I had it and so I think it looks perfect with the pink spoon rest and the rest of the books. And then I'm just going to add that wreath to the front door. And now I'm just sharing a quick recipe idea. I'm going to be making some lentil soup. It's one of our favorites to have here every week, so it's great for lunch or a side for dinner. I'm just chopping up some onion, tomato, and garlic, and then I'm going to add that to a pan with some olive oil, and then I'm going to be cutting up some carrots to go along with that, and it is just really, really delicious.
after boiling some water, I add in the lentils, which I let soak in a bowl for a little bit before. I feel like they just cook faster. And then I'll add in all of the vegetables, and you can pretty much do any vegetables that you have or want to add. And then for the seasonings, I do some chicken bouillon and some cumin, salt, and pepper. And you can pretty much just do anything to taste. It's just really simple and easy to do. I love making this on the weekends. So we have the lentil soup for the rest of the week. Just stay with me now till the morning light for you turn away. I just want you to know that I didn't throw your stuff away before you make up your mind that I'm nowhere to find them. And while the lentil soup is finishing up, just doing some really quick vacuuming. I swear that I'm sober, just listen. that's everything for today i hope that you guys enjoyed spending the day with me and got some cleaning motivation or a recipe idea thank you so much for watching if you're new i would love for you to subscribe and i will see you on my next one Being alone, well, I don't care, cause right now I feel